I'm uh, Rory Duff, um, the owner of PR Duff Limited, the, market the marketing company for McDuff Scotch Beef, along with Andrew, my son, who's here with me today. We're on one of our new member farms, um, John Marshall, um, from uh, it's near Straven in South Lanarkshire, south of Glasgow in Scotland. Um, and we're here looking at the cattle today. Behind me is some cows and calves, which are uh, the backbone of our, the Scottish beef industry. All these calves are uh, reared naturally on their mothers, um, unlike um, dairy beef, which comes from the, the dairy industry, a byproduct of the dairy, dairy industry. These calves stay on their mothers for nine months and are bred from beef cows and beef bulls. Um, as John says in his uh, uh, talk on the farm, the diet is very much grass-based. Uh, which is what we market as being a natural, natural eating, natural fodder for the cattle to uh, help the cattle fatten up and produce the quality beef that we market to our customers here in Scotland and in England. Um, behind me you can see the uh, different colours. That doesn't necessarily mean that they're uh, of a particular breed, but uh, we do obviously prefer the more traditional breeds um, which produce a slightly smaller carcasses than, than uh, maybe some of the, the bigger supermarkets want. Our butchers want a smaller carcass um, which uh, suits their customers better. Um, obviously the quality of the beef comes from the grass and the quality of the grass. Um, and one of my favourite topics of course is that ex-dairy farmers, as John Marshall indeed is, uh, who used to produce milk on a daily basis and they would know immediately the quality of the grass the next morning by the, mu the, the milk yield they got the next morning. Uh, so invariably, ex-dairy farmers produce the best grass, which in turn produces the best beef. You can't produce good beef from bad grass. So as we say, this is the, obviously we're looking at some of next year's crop. These cows won't be uh, marketed until next year. Um, but it is nice to see the quality and the quietness of the cattle here grazing in the sunshine. So hopefully, with everything going to plan, these will be the quality cattle coming to McDuff Beef next summer.